same grown salted uh, wonder worm as well. Just gonna enjoy the afternoon. Hope we enjoy and hope you enjoy. See you back now. Alright guys, Kurt's first course and this is Mr. Nice Fish. This is my first course. Look at this. Look at this. Kurt, on, on guys, very first course. That's my first course guys. What we have here. We have here. <laughs> Stop the nose. No, it's a little steam brush. <laughs> Good. Little steam brush. Good. Just missed one now. His first course as well, guys. Oh, lovely. Lovely stuff. This. You guys are close to it. My first course. Let's get this guy hooked and released. Oops. All right. Fish is on hook. Let's get him back. Oh, this guy's strong. This guy does not want to be touched. <laughs> Come on, I want to release you. I want to release you, buddy. Play along. There he goes, he's going to be going now Off he goes Oh, this is looking nice <laughs> We have the fish to ourselves guys My first class on a fish, first class class in Mr. Big Up What's happening here? a bit quiet here guys uh, I'm not sure if the fish we released spooked the, the shell because uh, Kurt lost three fish I picked up one and I'm not sure if that spooked them up and it went a bit quiet here. so I'm not sure what to do if we should persist with a bait uh, I'm not sure I might have a cast from the structure over here one or two casts for the sample and I've got one of them as well Give me a bird like we must have pushed over tide. Uh, the light push over tide, we came here basically in the heavy push over tide. And yeah, but as you can see, water quality here is much more, much better. But this area is much deeper than many of the other parts of Australia. Like uh, Melkby, very flat there. So with the push over tide and high tide, you have a lot of sand that's churned up like in front here. But as you can see, deeper on, water quality is a little bit better. Well, uh, areas like my cove layer is not as deep as here at Blake's, which, which is what makes Blake so so awesome. And I did not, I did not bring my big rod with, which I'm kind of regretting now. So I definitely would like to be out there much further. So I'm casting into the wind. It's not easy with a one ounce sinker. And I'm not sure if I'm getting enough distance to, to get to the fish. Perhaps on the fall of the tide, so I'm not sure what to do with the bait. I'm going to cast for 
probably a little bit deeper out might do the trick we'll see how this goes okay guys we have one or two cars here from the jet itself and the water is super deep here wow look at this place off beautiful isn't it wow Yeah, towards that side there obviously you've got ocean basket but Kofle and Gordon's brand it is like that you have a shop over there where you can buy whatever you need for kids here with a nice chair and relax and still catch fish small bait fish here which I doubt we will lose and the one is a leary and there's a stump close in there there's an elf might be two elf check it out Hey guys, go down there with the livey. A small little elf. Have a look at that. Good. 
Hi guys, good, 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 yeah. The almond. It's extraordinary. Absolutely extraordinary. This is why it makes us know the almond. Look at that. Here's the proof. Okay. Just get a close up of him. You will release him, guys. Oh wow. It's very sick of There he goes, I'm the worst for the guys. I'm on my spot, but I'm here right in front here. About two meters from where Kurt is standing now. <laughs> so if you think you're throwing too far, you're standing there. You want to throw up there. You're literally throwing over the fish's head. to get some live wait. How's it guys? Sun sitting there Over another day we're gonna have our last few cars here at Blix You guys enjoy See how it goes here for the last few minutes Got a few sand drones there We're gonna cast it out and head home Time now is 25 past 7 in the evening. With that cast there, this little fella came to say hello.